What's going on, nomads, party people, and strangers everywhere across the internet? My name is V, and I figured we'd kick off Nomadic Opinions off right by talking about something that went wrong of the dark universe of Universal Pictures. As well as how to fix it. Ooh, this is gonna get good. So as we all know, kicking off last year in 2017, was the initial step forward from Universal Pictures to revive the original shared universe of cinema's darkest monsters back in the day. Dracula, Wolfman, The Mummy, Frankenstein's Monster, Creature from the Black Lagoon, the list goes on and on. And the initial step forward for it, according to Universal, was The Mummy. As we disregard the other two attempts, of Dracula Untold and I Frankenstein. Cause yay for not trying to tie together a good story? <laughs> Anywho, from just that whole stepping stone forward for the official step forward in the, to the dark universe that they were trying to set up, albeit the same way DC tried to set up its own universe that we'll get into another opinions video about, we have The Mummy, which was a commercial failure. And I mean worse than how most people felt about the third Mummy movie in the Brendan Fraser trilogy. It was that bad. Like, so irredeemable that not even an animated series could make it any better. Like, so bad that The Room, one of the worst films in all of cinematic history according to most people, is laughing at it. So bad that Showgirls, who earned many Raspi Awards and gave so many actors Worst Actress of the Year nominees is laughing at The Mummy. That is how bad the film was, and it couldn't really have been avoided from how Universal was trying to do it, by jam-packing so much narrative and story to build up a universe so quickly that there wasn't any substance to sell the creature that they had as the initial film. Which is a shame for multiple reasons. Firstly, we had an actual female mummy taking the place of Imhotep, the original big mummy in all of the mummy retellings and the original Boris Karloff films. That was mistake number one to first downplay something that huge. A female mummy raising the dead using the magic of an ancient god in order to enact vengeance on the world. And how do they do that? With shitty backstory and not selling the character for nothing more than spank bank material as well as being kind of boring while also having the wooden actor of Tom Cruise. Along with that notion, like I said, jam-packing too much into one film to sell an entire universe that definitely could have used more breathing room by firstly having the jam-packed knowledge of Russell Crowe's Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde try to recruit Tom Cruise into a universe of trying to ascertain an army of monsters to defend other humans and monsters alike from darker monsters which also held red herrings to the Invisible Man, Creature from the Black Lagoon, so forth and so on. Which would have been nice to see all of them in independent films. So we had a muddled mess. We had a terrible, terrible backstory for a promising character. And we had such wooden dialogue choices in a film that looks so promising that it's basically pissing away anything that could have been good about a dark universe involving the big monsters that most of our parents and grandparents grew up watching in cinemas. Great job, Universal. You're doing just as bad a job as DC right now. Not even gonna ask. Okay, okay, I, I hear you, past self. I hear you, but uh, let's talk about how we could fix this hot mess in just two simple ways. Number one, let's not oversaturate the story with too many characters. A universe has to be sold one installment at a time. 
Universal, you knew this years ago. You gave Marvel its formula straight down the line to where they could just finesse it the fuck all the way into stardom from just Iron Man alone to where we are now, where we're waiting for Infinity Wars to happen with the Infinity Gauntlet. So, yeah, having it just one installment at a time would have been enough to sell the Dark Universe premise, along with not announcing there is a Dark Universe to start with. The Marvel Cinematic Universe did not actually exist until after having many different films come into play and then selling itself as the MCU. That is that. After which, there's only a second way you could fix this film. Actually do more with the story. From a premise of a female mummy, from an entire sausage fest of characters, there are numerous things you could have done with this whole story to make it more unique and a lot more detailed than how you did it. If you were to be like, oh, she's pretty much the descendant from one of the Egyptian gods and was slated to be the ruler, but was almost usurped by her younger brother who tried to place a coup on her because he wanted to instill a totalitarianistic government, which would then lead into something historically accurate, that would have been enough to sell the picture. Or at least sell enough to want to have more backstory exposed on her if there was a universe to continue. Along with those lines, make the human story not a blatant insult or something very dramatic for the sake of being dramatic. Make it very constructed. Make it very uniquely to the format of why would they be looking for a mummy in the first place. Like the Boris Karloff or with the Brendan Fraser mummies, using archaeologists or people that love to study Egyptian history really do sell the production for what it is for a narrative. It takes liberties to be unique, and that is what made those films good, unlike this portrayal of the mummy for the Dark Universe. Those are two of the most basic ways you can fix this whole entire hot mess, and you know what, guys? This took me less time to figure out than Universal Pictures themselves. Now that may be because I might have thought this a little bit more thoroughly since I want to make a shared universe myself and are in the works to do so. Or it could be the fact that unlike a lot of people that try to just hate on it for the sake of hating it, I try to study how to improve it in case people want to revive this idea. Just for the sake of being somewhat more tolerable about it. But still, those are just my whole grand things about where it failed and how to fix the whole thing of the Dark Universe from just the mummy standpoint alone. I could go into more details with you guys about it, but we've already extended the time and pushed back this video long enough. I'll be doing a follow-up video about the Dark Universe stuff when more details about what's going on right now start to be unraveled, such as The Bride of Frankenstein. But until then, hit it! Turn me on, say your hand on spare the phone, and go a little soul.